This morning, here's the Telegraph to start with. Leads with the government's plans to phase out the use of coal and certain types of wood in the home. Wood burning stoves and open fires are apparently the most harmful pollutant which affects people in the UK, according to the Environment Secretary. We'll give... Just a few more details, by the way, if you like a real fire at home and you're hearing this morning about possibly coal and wood fires being affected by this ban on certain fuels, and the Daily Telegraph is leading with this. The problem is particularly wet wood and coal, which releases these very um, dangerous pollutants. Um, under the terms of the ban, coal and wood... Um, coal... Bags of coal would be banned from sale at supermarkets. Wet wood would also be banned from sale. Certain coal is allowed, smokeless coal is allowed, and dry wood, uh, which doesn't release the same kind of pollution as those ones. So um, that is all in the uh, Telegraph this morning, but picked up by some of the other papers as well. It's all about well. the point of sale, isn't it? It's what the state yeah. of it when you, when you buy it. Yeah, yeah and, and the weather as it is at the moment, there'll be plenty of people still sparking up their fires and their wood burners at home. At this time of year. I tell you, I've been all over the country this week and there's a lot of wet wood out there, I can assure you. Uh, it's... The sale of coal and some types of wood for open fires and stoves will be banned in England from next February as part of the government's efforts to cut air pollution. Instead, people will have to buy smokeless coal or wood that has been seasoned or dried in kilns. Wood burners and coal fires are the largest source of an air pollutant which can cause lung cancer, strokes and asthma.